Good e morning, evening, or afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, but you uh, ladies and gentlemen in particular. Today, we will be playing The Ratula, which as an aspiring single young rodent, we will be looking for a little bit of love tonight. So which, which one do you reckon suits me best? Hmm. <coughs> I mean, this one <coughs> looks like it's covered in fleas. This one looks like it's the type to enjoy long walks on the beach. That one. That one looks like an exotic dancer to me. And this one just looks like a plain old boring bitch. So, frankly, I reckon we'll go with the flea infested one. That one really feels like it would speak to, uh... You know, that feels like it'd really speak to us as a rat. You know, I feel like fleas, you know, it's part of it. Anyway, we got quite a number of suitors here, as you can see. Uh, Mig Mouse. I'm not sure why a rat would be going out with a mouse, but I respect it. I mean, this guy's basically just covering the whole screen. He's, this kid's probably a six-time divorcee, or maybe a one-time divorcee. I don't actually know how many kids rats have, so, you know. Well, I'd be playing just for a small family of 60. This guy's got a crown, so he might be rich. I reckon we can make something out of that. Definitely a rat looks good. Um, what do we reckon? This guy looks like a compulsive gambler. That screams divorce in a couple years time. And this guy is a delusional airhead. Perfect. I reckon we go for it. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, I don't even... <laughs> this dude... Okay, can I just say, right... How big is a rat's dick compared to the rest of this body? Because this guy has to be packing, alright? I'm just saying, maybe that ain't a tail, alright? I'm going to give him a very interesting... I respect it. Oh shit, he actually is a single parent. <laughs> alright, he's got what, six kids? That's... Either a lot of work or not a lot of work. Again, not really sure on the whole rat thing. Um, <laughs> I'm just gonna say he's different, you know. He's he's clearly he's clearly out there. He's clearly, you know. I spend all my time working out my lats, glutes, and delts, but taking a break from my workout is all worth it if I get to meet you. Are those are those are those tits or are those a six pack? Do, 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 do male rats have tits like guy like male humans do? You know, because we still got a pair. Are they packing as well? Because I'm assuming, I'm pretty sure if it's anything like Warhammer Fantasy with Skaven, I feel like don't don't rats have like a million tits? I mean, hey, that's better than just two if you ask me. I'll take it. I value you. Yes. You're a real contributor to society. No big deal, but you, did you know I actually starred in your favorite movie? Yeah, that was me. I looked different at that time, though. They did my makeup. Are you wearing a dress, or is that just, like, part of your body? I'm... I mean, the name is a real rat, so I do have to, you know, I'm just going to say yikes, because that's looking like a yikes for me. Oh, what's this little yellow ribbon for? Never you might. No, I think I do mind. All right. If you're going to be into choking, I'd like to have a little bit of uh, a pre-warning before we get to the foreplay. So, yeah, I'm just going to hit you with a wow. Don't wink at me. Meep, meep, meepo e. Uh, what? I thought he's a king, but apparently he might be a fucking robot instead. 
Hey, cool cat. You ever seen someone who can do two magic tricks at once? You know, I was going to say something smart ass, but I think I will just keep that one to myself instead. Um, so do you know your dad or no? Just sort of trying to get the vibe here, you know? Just, uh, yeah, that's nice, bro. It's lovely. Who gets a rose? Well, okay. Bear seems like a lovely man, all right? Bear seems lovely to me. And look, you know what? I can roll with some choking. Hey, hey, look. If he's into it, knock me out, chief. Metaphorically, at least, you know. So, gotta, gotta be careful with that uh, asphyxiation. Can get quite dangerous too, actually. You would be surprised how many people have died from erotic asphyxiation. All right, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I like, I like how big the rose is on him compared to this guy. What about, what about? <laughs> He's literally just in the fucking rose. All right, all right. That one was actually worth it. I reckon I want to hear more from Daddy Issues and uh, Mr. Single Dad. I, I reckon I reckon I want to hear more from Daddy Issues. He seems like an interesting chap. Do you like music too? You should meet the bandmates at some point. Oh, he's in a band. Wow. That's my first reaction. What does he play? Bass? It's time you met my children, Reggie997, Evangeline, Esquire, Junior, Sharpie, and Trash. Can't wait. One, two, three, four, five. That's only five. There's six here. How come you've only given us five names when there's six kids? That doesn't seem right. I've been told these violet my eyes of mine are more purple than all the lavender in the world, and I can certainly smell. I certainly smell better too. Oh, whoa. Did he just fucking awoke us? Okay, hold, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, okay. You're a dude, for a start, okay? That's already, like, nigh on unacceptable. Second of all, can Rance even a wall? Like, like, is that, is that, like, physically possible? You know? I'm just asking, um... Yeah, you know what? Yeah, that's that's nice. That's nice. You 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 go do that. I'd love to get you know me be I'd love to get to know you better. My parents always taught me to treat others with respect and listen more than you talk. Look at me going on about my family. I mean I, I like I like that your parents taught you that, but I don't really think you picked up on their listen. Cause clearly you are all about you and I'm just not sure if that's you know I just I'm not sure if that's for me I apologize also I like my dude six foot plus so hey look you didn't exactly give me a lot of options one time I was running with the gang back at Cirque du Soleil and as soon as that elephant got on stage some acrobat was doing gymnastics on its back while well, all guys were on him I ran to the admission desk and booked it with the ticket stubs been living off that dollar ever since. Here, do you want some? Hands you a dot. Wait, what? I'm confused. Oh, he he stole it. Never mind. I just got it. He's saying that while all the eyes are on the acrobat, he's he fucking dipped with all the cash. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, I'm just... Uh, I don't know if you'd really want to admit to a felony on TV. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go with Bear. I like it. I'm the only one who can like it like that. Mick Mouse, he's a genuine guy. You can clearly see he, uh, he's at least willing to listen. Even if, you know, he's not necessarily great at it at least he tries all right it's it's the thought that counts after all especially when you're looking at rats all right um you're you just admitted a felony on tv so you're probably going to jail for a very long time so i kind of just have to pick the other ones 
Um, even if I don't even know all your kids' names, I only know five out of six of them, and I've already forgotten those five as well. Reggie977 and Esquire Jr. are twins, but you wouldn't know it because Esquire Jr. is way uglier. Why the fuck are you insulting your kids, okay? You're supposed to be having kids with me and this is how you treat them? How do you reckon that's gonna go down? Mm -mm. No, thank you, dick. I was doing some crunches earlier. When you popped into my head, I couldn't stop thinking about you. It was so inspiring, I actually beat my personal record. This might sound silly, but I've never felt like this before. You know what? You know what? That's actually one of the nicest things that's been said so far. I used to be a lab rat. They were experimenting on me with growth serum. Damn, does everything grow there or? You know, I've got to make sure you satisfy my rat needs in every ravishing way possible. Just, uh, hypothetically speaking. <clears throat> you know what, That's that sounds very interesting. That's nice. Bear, Bear seems like a very nice individual. You know, a bit like a BFG, a big, friendly grat. When I see you, I see all the stars in the world, a constellation of thought and love and joy. What is the juice, by the way? I'm still wondering what the juice is, because they keep on bringing up juice. Well, look, obviously Bear's going to get it, and I reckon Ming gets it too. This guy, though, the purple eyes, I don't know, I just ain't digging it, all right? I'm sorry, man. I'm going to have to choke, I mean, cut you off. Chit chat. Evangeline's piano recital is coming up and Sharpie is jealous because they just started learning to play the bass while Evangeline is already getting interviews at Julia. What? Julia? What? What? What is Julia? Sorry, I've never heard of that. I'm assuming it's like a famous music school. Hold up. It's a famous performing arts conservatory in New York City. A... 7% graduate, uh, 7 acceptance rate, 92% graduation rate, and a 30k average cost. Hmm. Interesting. Wow, that's so impressive. At least some of your kids aren't failures. Not as flashy as on the other ads, but I can give you what you need. A good life with a caring partner. Who will honor and respect you every day. I'm a family rights man. You know what? You know what? Honestly, Mink Mouse is sounding like the best fella here. Except maybe Bear. I can't decide between Bear and Mig right now. Sometimes I like to go to the auto shop and watch them work on cars. Once I drove there, but my car was too small and they almost stepped on it. Thought it was a Hot Wheels. It's not though. It runs on renewable energy. I mean, good. I like to. I like to see that he's environmentally conscious. Look, I'm sorry, man. You did. You did insult your kids earlier, so it's gonna have to be a no for me. I'm sorry. Picked this up for you. It's a sandwich from my aunt's bakery down near the promenade. Cheese and more cheese with a bit of tomato and a single leaf special just for you. Cool. He gave me a sandwich. It's very thoughtful of him. I can't get out of my head. I wake up every morning thinking of you. Usually I wake up thinking about protein powder. What's happening to me? I want to wake up to you every morning forever. Have you heard of CrossFit? Honestly, honestly, you know, he's a bit of a gym jockey, but he does seem like a very lovely person. Bear seems very genuinely caring as well, but... I don't know if a sandwich is just going to cut it. You know, I think, unfortunately, I think I have to go with Mig Mouse. Even if the ring is almost as big as his head. Alright, that one's getting the screenshot. Uh, except I just opened a million but. Yeah, 
Banner. That's getting a screenshot right there. I'm not so good with words, but you need to know something. I truly love you with every muffle, tendon, and fiber in my body. I really do, and I'll go on loving you forever. I want to start a family together. I want you to meet my mum. I'm all in. They are both not rats. Bear and Logan go on a nature hike. I'm glad Bear's happy. Vin and the kids enjoyed their fun. One day Jerry finds comfort in Slim Jim's arm. Jerry took off and hasn't been seen in a while. Probably running from a hit from the guy he robbed. Hyperdean and Man Manello share tender moments. Nice. Well, anyway, I think I found my thumbnail though. Sheesh, that, that mouse is a fit boy. Can I just say? And I think I'll make a great dad. So, anyway, guys. Glad, it, you know, glad we could finish it off with a happy ending. This rat just found love. And I'll see you all next video.